Yeah, I'm, I couldn't be any more excited. I think it's just going to be so well received. But you know, you can feel the passion. Yeah. And you can feel what's behind it. It's it's not just doing something for sake. You know, you know what I mean. When, when right. there's passion and there's that kind of depth behind something, you feel it. And people people sense that and they get behind it. Yeah. And and there's nothing more powerful than touching people. Well, Inspiring. that's really why, you know, when you write a poem, until someone hears it, it's not really complete. And it doesn't really matter if they know why you wrote it or what prompted you. If they take it and it strikes someplace in, of, for themselves, that poem becomes theirs. And you have to be able to, you have to be prepared that sometimes, you know, people might read something that you wrote and and they'll tell you how much it meant to them and because they think it's about one thing totally different than than what you wrote it about so that's uh, a kind of an interesting experience because it doesn't really matter why I wrote it once it once it's out there it has a life of its own I have to let it go there's a painting. There's a painting on my bedroom wall that was done by a person who went to a poetry reading I did, and this one particular poem just struck her in such a way, and she went home and painted this big painting I have in my bedroom. You know. So if you'd like to see that painting, you could you could go take a picture of it. Absolutely. Yeah. And I I could recite the poem for you. It's very oh, short. Oh, yeah. yeah. There have been some really sad things in my life, uh, in my earlier life. And um, so that's what she's taken note of up there in the gravestones. And, and this little tiny figure here it was me when I wrote, was me when I wrote the poem. Uh -huh. And the, here's the poem. It goes, by tiny bits and pieces I'd given me away to time and things and people till there was nothing left one day. I reached out my left my clenched hand and opened it to see the one called friend place in it a tiny bit of me. <laughs> oh, and that's, that's beautiful. And that's the painting she did because of that poem. When somebody does that, that's powerful. I, You've touched them. I, 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 am so, I, I was so humbled when she gave me the painting. I, 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 I didn't know what to say.